everyone, this is the Mad Salvi letting you know that unless things are proven with Twitter posts and stuff like that and actual, have actual proof behind it, treat everything in this thing as a theory. I will mark try to mark certain things as news and theory and everything like that to kind of let you guys understand, but also, you know, use a critical mind. And I hope you do enjoy. Hello, everyone. We have big news today. Minato Aqua has announced that they will be graduating uh, from Hololive Productions on August 28th. It says, Minato Aqua will be graduating from Hololive. The graduation broadcast will be on August 28th. I'll run at full speed until the end, so please support me. Let's make this the best summer ever. And we have Hololive English announcing to, for the English fans, because they absolutely know that English fans are going to be all in on this. Minato Aqua of Hololive Second Generation will be graduating on August 28th. We thank her for all she has done for us until now and are grateful for the support of fans who have been with her during her activities with us. A graduation live concert is scheduled for August 28th. Please await further details. We will continue to provide full support until the time of graduation, and we kindly ask for your unwavering support and encouragement from Minato Aqua. We wish all, her all the best in her endeavors. Details. Let's go over first what they have. There's the, the, the Japanese announcement, and they made an announcement for English. Of course, it is that white background with the black text. It says, Announcement of Minato Aqua's graduation. Thank you for your continued support of Minato of, of Hololive Production. We regret to inform you that on August 28, 2024, Minato Aqua will graduate from the VTuber group Hololive. To all fans and related parties, we sincerely apologize to the sudden announcement. We appreciate the warm support you have given Aqua until now. And we are truly grateful from the bottom of our hearts. Minato Aqua has been one of the early members, uh, one of the members pivotal in contributing to the growth of Hololive Productions from its early days. Serving as part of Hololive's second generation for approximately six years. We are sincerely grateful for her contributions and in light of that we have accepted her request for graduation. So this was a request from her. This harkens to maybe something going on in Hololive Productions JP. As, as I've always told you guys, I am neutral. I try to stay objective to everything. I will call out anybody, any organization, whether it be Hololive or whether it be uh, Nidhi Sanji, I call them out if they're doing something wrong. We're planning a graduation live stream on August 28th, the day of her graduation, and also the following. Minato Aqua's graduation live concert, Minato Aqua's merchandise sales, a special program on Hololive official channel, and a special feature of talent channels. It says, please wait for further announcements regarding the schedule for each of the above. In addition, for information on merchandise related to Minato Aqua, and other merchandise mentioned above. Please refer to the Hololive production official announcements. The official shop is there. Uh, fan letters will be accepted until Friday, September 6th, so it's beyond her graduation. Details about membership and membership-only content will be provided separately. More than likely, what they always do is that they uh, tend to either private everything or leave it up depending on the severity of the situation. They might leave it up kind of like how they did Kiryu Koko. We will see what happens. Continue to support her fully until graduation. We would like to ask for your full unwavering support of the remaining time until her graduation. And here we have uh, Fumitsu also doing this. But before we go to the Fumitsu thing, um, we will actually, you know, let me just go to the Fumitsu and give you everything. A virtual maid who was active as a member of the second generation of Hololive. Outstanding gamer, having achieved solo mastery in Apex. Because I want to go into what Aqua says. And this is important to what Aqua says. This, this part is what I wanted to mention. <clears throat> because I'm going to go through the actual uh, snippet where she mentions everything in her stream where she uh, did the announcement. But first, <clears throat> I want to show you this, which is a little bit of a hearkening to really something something is going on behind the scenes. I don't know what it is, but something is. In a song stream August 1st, she made an ominous statement saying, if something were to happen to me, I want you to know that there is a great power at work that I cannot accept. I will live tomorrow as well for justice. I will not give up. I hereby swear to keep fighting. This had some fans asking if she was graduating. The result was of her graduating. So because of that, let's hear it in her words. Of course, I will come out the other side with my take on the whole situation. But in this one, it is serious enough that I do not want to put any commentary on here. And I do not want to interrupt it. I will let her say her piece. ありがとうございました。最後に私はみんなに話しておきたいことがあります。今後わかるかもしれないし、わかるかもし、わかる。いいところで噛んだ。わからないかもしれない。それでは最後の曲聞いてください。Stay 
That is what she had to say about this situation. It is crazy as a Hololive fan, as someone who's followed Hololive before, for a liver to say that. <clears throat> that means that there is something going on. We can't know exactly what's going on. We can't know uh, what is going on behind the scenes because, of course, uh, as Japanese people, as far as I understand, they are very reserved with what they say and they try to protect their uh, the organization. They try to protect the whole instead of themselves they do that kind of stuff and aqua overall has always been an introvert she has always been someone who is kind of a little bit more on the shy side more on the side of you know being cautious very much so um so this this kind of goes more on the type of person that she is we will go over also um marine because a lot of people have gone over a lot of what she said basically it says i will continue to support you from now on this is a response directly to her saying on uh that she is going to be graduating as of you know august 28th she will be graduated it says i will continue to support you from now on too this is from bay thank you very much until now let's have fun until the end okami mio says aqua can shine the brightest no matter where you are our life will be lonely without aqua but we support Aqu what aqua wants to do thank you for making so many memories together we have <clears throat> Bay giving some um the actual on Bay's channel on Bay's uh, Twitter says although the moments I spent you with, with you were few I will always hold them dear to me she will forever be a part of Hollow Life family let's treasure it the remaining time we have together please take care of yourselves and people of course you know <clears throat> showing Bye. the recent Bye. time that she was with Aqua. Showing off her Stegosaurus. Aqua, I love Aqua. <laughs> that's cute. That is cute. A Stegosaurus named I Love Aqua. That, that's the kind of experiences that they had together. Let's see what other people are saying. Um, Koyori says, I hope this, this will be the best summer ever. One with Aqua Senpai will always remember fondly. One that she will always remember fondly. I feel a lot of sadness, but I hope we can make memories together this summer with smiles on our faces. I sincerely love Aqua Senpai because she's cute, hardworking, and a strong personality. Now, a lot of them, a lot of them found this out before it was announced by Aqua and before it was announced by Hololive. Uh, because as we know with Kiryu Koko and as we know with others, they inform the talents before they make the official announcement. That's one good thing that they do. But something is odd here. Something is going on here. Maybe it's just my weird way of thinking. But something is hitting a lot harder than it should. This should not have happened uh, on normal circumstances. It could be, yes, I'm moving on to other things. But the whole thing of it being... Um, something that she can't take anymore, or, you know, I believe what it said in the original one was, um, Aqua will be graduating from Hololive, run at full speed, please support me. The, the whole message that she put out on the video itself is kind of indicative of something going on. That there are parts that she cannot accept, and there were differences with management, and all those types of things are, there are harbingers of bad things. It, it, they are a large Japanese corporation. They are a monolithic corporation. They are old school with the way that they do things. And they are old school in the way that they treat people in the sense that it is a lot of times old fogies and things like that inside of the organization that make it hard for anyone else to be, you know, normal in the situation. So yeah, Coyote was saying all that wonderful stuff. It says, although I knew about it before everyone else, when I heard it from her personally, I realized it was real. And to be honest, I'm very sad. I felt a variety of thoughts and intentions when Aqua Senpai said, see you tomorrow. I want to spend the day smiling together with you on, until graduation day. We have Raura Pantera saying, You have always been my idol. I'm truly grateful to be an idol like you one day. I want to be an idol like you one day. I thank you for everything you have done for me. Your songs will always be in my heart. And she says here on uh, you know, on her actual separate post, Aqua Senpai's voice will always echo in my heart. I'll forever be a huge fan of hers. For the remaining time, let's make this the best summer ever. And we have Nodoka, which is staff. Nodoka was like Achan in staff. So Aqua, so that Aqua can run to the end, we will support you with all our might. The attitude of working on one thing single-mindedly, very I was very inspired by it. Thank you for all the memories, dreams, smiles, and let's paint this summer in aqua colors. You have Fuamoko saying uh, here, I love Aqua Senpai songs, and when I was in incarcerated, which basically, you know, the advent of them, them being uh, jailbreaking, I listened to them all the time, and they soothed me. I'll do my best to become a cute and soothing Hololive member like Aqua Senpai. I have lot let's have lots of fun remaining time we love you aqua senpai uh raiden from regloss says 
I can't thank you enough for inviting me to join Karkaro Squad during ARC and for teaching me so kindly because, of course, Ao didn't know, like, like uh, Ao, Raiden, a lot of people don't, Raiden don't know a lot about uh, ARC. I mean, if ARC is a hard one to learn. So, yeah, you have people like Aqua teaching you everything. Um, to be honest, I'm, I'm incredibly lonely and I can't find the words to express it. But Aqua Senpai is a senior I've always looked up to. Even after graduation, we will meet again somewhere. And that is a thing that happens, you know, after graduation, Kiryu Koko, she still is in contact with uh, former, uh, like, she's a former talent. She's still in contact with the current talents. Uh, Kanade from Rigos also says, Aqua Senpai, even before Kanade joined Hololive, I've been watching her songs and streams as a viewer. Thank you for all the fun memories. I actually regret not having many opportunities to interact with Aqua Senpai. I'm very sad, but I'll continue to support you. I admire you. Let's have a great summer. We have Narissa Ravencroft. You will be deeply missed by everyone. You have Kureji Ali. Let's make it the best summer. Short and succinct. It does happen. Yes. You have Saya Synchronicity, who says, Thank you for your best for the best memories. I will continue to support you. Uh, Inaba says, Thank you for your hard work. I'll be cheering you on until the end. We have more. Korone, uh, Hollow Life says, I'll always leave the swing open for you. You have Aski who says, I love Akutan because she's so single-minded and puts more in more effort than anyone else. I'll support Akutan on whatever path she chooses. He and she is kind of interchangeable in the Japanese language from what I understand. Until the very end, thank you very much. Mio, again, like no, uh, uh, I went over her message before about, you know, um, she, she can shine brightest no matter what. Hala will be lonely without Aqua, but we support what Aqua wants to do. Thank you for making so many memories together. We have uh, Noel. Akatan is really hard worker and stoic. I've respected her since ever before I joined Hololive. This announcement is very sad, but I'm rooting for Akatan as she continues to run at full speed until graduation. Because even after graduation, we'll always be friends. I make dry curry anytime. Love it. We have I Airani, EO15, Iofi, saying yes, have fun until the end. Sora, Tokino Sora, saying let's have the best summer ever, Akutan. Uh, Shishiro Botan says, wishing you a wonderful summer with a smile. Tsunomaki Watame says, is it okay if I keep singing Aqua Color Palette? Aqua Color Palette is the original song for Aqua. It is an amazing song. Uh, I recommend you listen to it. It is a good one. Uh, How to Life usually hits it out of the park for any and all of those types of things. Um, before I continue beyond there, I do want to mention what Maureen said. Here's Maureen's uh, message uh, that she had during her stream. Again, I will see you guys on the other side. I do not want to put any commentary on here because I want you guys to hear it directly from their mouth. ま、アドバイスくれたの。もう本当にそんなこと知らなかったし、なんかただ運ゲーで活躍してるんだなって気づきを得た瞬間だった。それまではマリンは完全運ゲー化才能ゲーだと思っていたんだが、で、船長はだからマジ
あーってなるけどいてくれるだけでも嬉しいなって思うから前はちょっとヨボヨボになってしまってもなんとかギリしがみつこうかなと思いますけどねそうシオンタンはほらちょっと休止しててもさいてくれるじゃんいつか戻ってくるんだなって思うじゃんそれって嬉しいことだなと改めて思ったっていう話ね。And that is Marines、uh... Take on the whole thing. And like she mentioned, it is something that hits you hard when someone's going to graduate. Someone who's been there since the beginning, like since a very long time. She's second generation, so she's been there. She's one of the longest ones out there, besides first generation, you know, Soda and all them, generation zero, etc. They've been there longer, of course.、Um, Aqua was always very timid, and but always, like she said, she worked hard. She did. She put effort into everything. Maybe effort that wasn't seen by a lot, but she put effort into anything. And for her to leave in the way that she has, like I said, it, hope, I hope that I'm wrong. But if I am right about there being some stuff behind the scenes,、uh, at least on the JP side, of course, I will bring more news to that and I will criticize where criticism is due. But right now, we don't know anything. We're running on, you know, rumors and such like that, that there's big things happening, but we don't know. Uh, we continue with Takanashi Kiara, Aqua Senpai. There's no one who could replace Aqua Senpai. I think she's an important member. So, although there will be a big hole in my, her, her, in my heart, I hope you will be proud of what you have done so far and move forward on your future path with a positive attitude. We didn't have that much interaction, but I'll never forget Aqua Senpai. Who helped to enliven Hololive. Thank you for your continued support and the rest of the,、uh, for the rest of the time. And Hololive,、uh, Aqua felt like in Hololive that she was not. Like, you were never gonna see her leave. Like, she was not gonna go anywhere. She felt like one of the, the pillars of Hollow Life.、Uh, I, I'm gonna.、Uh, Kanata. Kanata just said, I don't like it.、Um, and that is, that is saying a lot with the little bit of words. That's what's making people think that something is up, you know.、Uh, Marine, as we had just talked to, said,、uh, if, we, if it weren't for Aqua, Aqua Tan, I wouldn't have thought about joining Hollow Life.、Uh, Captain, she's always been a senior I looked up to. When we talked to behind the scenes, She gave me a lot of advice, and without it, the captain would never have thought about aiming higher. Aquamarine is forever parent and child. And there's, you know, one of Aqua's、uh, summer outfits, and, you know, Marine giving that last、uh, bit of hurrah to her. Then we have Yago, one of the, the goats, of course, Yago, saying, Thank you so much, Aqua san. We are grateful for your hard work over the past six years as one of Hollow Life's original members. Thank you for all your fans. Thank you to all the fans for your support. Up until now. Please continue to support us until the end. And of course, that is something that you don't hear from any other organization. Like, smaller organizations are taking this as a lesson and actually trying to do it. But from large organizations like Hololive, like Cover, like Nidhi Sanji, and any color, the only one you hear this from, from the big two, are Cover and Yago. So that gives something. And of course, Koseki Biju is like Senpai. She's very sad, of course, about the situation that happened.、Um, Ayame just puts the, the sad emoji, the crying emoji. Nakari Ayame also says, I'm sad because I thought we'd be together forever. If I'm not mistaken, they are part of the same generation.、Uh, Pekora says, If we hadn't become friends, I wouldn't have felt this way. Basically, with the sadness that she feels、uh, about what is going on, it wouldn't have been so sad if they hadn't become friends.、Uh, it is hard for everybody. And as mentioned before,、uh, Fuamoko goes and actually says, I love you, Aka Senpai. She will always be the senior that Fuamoko looks up to. We have here,、uh, Choko saying, Chairman Ichan Akuchan, Akutan, the third graduate. Deep down, I really hate it. I, but I'm going to take my time to sort out my feelings and see them off with a smile. Let's get through this together. She went and did,、uh, she had a collab stream soon after this. She said that she was going to be streaming with a smile, and she did that. She streamed with a smile. I'm pretty sure because of the closeness that these girls always have with each other, there were lots of tears shed. There was lots of calls between each other. There's lots of support, of course. But tears were, of course, shed because of the situation. It is a sad one for anybody involved. Anya says, I'm sad, devastated, shaking. Even before joining Hololive, she was one of the members I watched the most, and she was and still is a huge inspiration for me. I'm going to miss her a lot. But let's treasure the remaining time we have with her and send her off with a smile. Of course, that's what you do. I'm going to be watching Aqua's.、Uh, Graduation, even if it's at freaking four in the morning, I'm gonna wake up, I'm gonna watch it because I always want to watch the graduation streams of every single member when I have the chance to. If they ever graduate, if they ever have these big type of things, I do want to watch it because it is important, at least the way I see it. It is、uh, a good send off. Then we have Okayu saying, You were such a cute senior and always took care of me. Love you, Aqua. I'm so lonely, but I want to see you off with a smile. 
And that's where I leave you off with this uh, announcement again. This is Aqua saying that she's going to be broadcasting uh, last broadcast on August 28th. It's going to be a graduation live. At the very least, it is going to be something that is going to be celebrated. It's going to be something that is going to be like, as I showed you before, everybody responded to it. It's going to be something that is important for the community. It's going to be something that's important for all, for you know anyone who is a, a VTuber enjoyer, is a enjoyer of Hololive, is an enjoyer of Aqua Senpai, Aqua San, whatever you want to call her, Aqua Chan. She is a hard worker, and it is kind of disheartening that she felt there were enough differences between her and management that she had to leave. Once again, these were due to differences between her and management. Her cryptic message says it all. There was something that she could not, uh, cannot stand, could not support. Something happened and that made her leave. And that is why I wanted to make this special video on the whole situation, uh, covering everything. Of course, it is a shockwave through the community. And I did want to be as objective as I can, but this something stinks around here. Something's going on. Hopefully we get to figure out what it is and hopefully whatever it is, if it is a failing on Hololive's part, they fix it because I will create a critic of them until they fix it as I am with any agency that makes a mistake. This is an opinion or side idea or whatever. Uh, BlackRock is a large investment group. They invest billions in different corporations in the US. Uh, they influence those corporations with the money that they have in there. So uh, I think it was BlackRock that does a lot of um, the uh, diversity stuff. They push a lot of diversity stuff. I am neither here nor there about it. I'm very objective on the whole thing, but they seem to really be doing the diversity stuff um, when it comes to everything. So uh, who knows what this means with a uh, cover. Uh, they, they have such a small amount right here, as you can see, 0.56, not even 1%, but that's still a lot of shares. Uh, don't they invest in basically everything? Exactly. It's like Andresen Horowitz getting Twitch streamers involved in their games division. They're the world's largest asset manager. They own stocks and shares in everything. $10 trillion in assets, and they barely own half a percent of share covered. They're also passive funds, so it's not likely they would uh, probably know what it is, what's happening in the VTubing world anyways. They probably wouldn't even have anything to do with what's going on future because of the fact that, like I like it's saying here, it is a, just an agency that it's managing different assets. They're seeing places that they can diversify and they just diversify where they can. CEO Larry Fink is effectively on a crusade to change the world. Um, so if they get bigger, if they get like 10% or whatever, then you know that maybe they're going to try to do something, but we don't know yet. Uh, we can't really put words in anybody's mouths, but it is risky still because like the, the, like I said here, the CEO is trying to make a lot of changes. And once you get to a certain size, you do get a certain say in the organization, at least a little bit cover always pushes back. So I don't think covers at risk for that, but that is a, there's a chance of it being attempted at least. This is someone's attempt at a meme. I say attempt because this is, um, they're saying that her, that Aqua's graduation was because she's taking the easy way out. I don't really think that, um, this is a little bit different from the usual meme time. This is like meme deconstruction, meme uh, criticism time. Uh, I forgot to not only hire a lot of golden eggs, but also the FA and Nostradamus herself. She gives up easily and takes the easy way. That's I was talking about Aqua. Um, it was fortune reading that was for Aqua herself. Um, it's the path of least resistance, of course. Uh, Graduating is not the path of least resistance when it comes to uh, Aqua, when it comes to what she's done, because of the fact that she's been there for six years, six years is not the path of least resistance. Of course, what she means there is that, you know, that is a personality trait that Aqua is known for being very timid, timid, not wanting to uh, go and make waves, not wanting to do that. That's what Mio meant by that. Not, um, this was done way before the graduation, but not that, you know, oh, she's going to be graduating and that's taken the easy way out. There's a lot of things that go on with graduations. I've never, ever seen a graduation as taken the easy way out. I've always seen it as a personal decision, whether it be Nidhi Sanji, whether it be uh, Idol, whoever it be, it is a personal decision that they make, that they're trying to make in order to do better for themselves or to go against a specific dislike of what's going on. Because as, as Aqua mentioned, there's something going on behind the scenes that she did not agree with. And that is why there was differences. And that's why she left. Aqua is an extremely introverted person. So being in Hololive and Idol Entertainment Company for six years is not an easy path to take for her. So yeah, pretty much it's like Mio is saying this just about, you know, her general way that she is. 
uh, you know, as in like not wanting to go against the grain, not wanting to hurt anyone else, that type of thing, not the whole graduation being an easy way out. Hello everyone and welcome to the VTuber Showcase, a place where I try to give a little bit back to the community that gave me so much in the form of showcasing indie VTubers, just announced VTubers, mid-sized VTubers, any VTuber who wants to be shown on here, I will show them. Uh, this is Mariko the Cactopus, the Mariko, 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 whichever one you want to say it. This little cat octopus girl who tries to be your second favorite. Here is their post that they have here. It's just a regular post of, you know, showing a little bit of their tail stuff. Kind of cute. I kind of like the tail stuff. Just, you know, being cute, being cute, which is good. Uh, and she is growing, of course, as mentioned here. Um, we have her uh, Twitch channel, which doesn't have any videos yet. So she hasn't decided to post up yet. Uh, it is pretty much in the very early stages one of the few times i have someone in the early stages like i do right now uh hopefully they do grow and they seem to have a very cute design um and you know they have other showing all their their different um toggles and all those types of things they, they did 100 500 followers already and just you know giving you guys a little bit of feel for them of course the uh socials will be in the description below as well as the form if you are a VTuber who wants to be showcased on the channel on any of the videos popping up. That is all for right now. Of course, comment, like, and subscribe down below. Thank you for being here. Of course, I love having the conversations with you guys. I love having these things with you guys, and I do appreciate it whenever you guys do comment. Take a look at my description for my socials. There's a Discord, there's Twitter, there's other places that you can check me out, Twitch, etc. And also check on your screen right now because there might be a video that you might enjoy. Thank you.